Dave Michaluzzi. That's uh, it's a hell of a way to play an Australian Open in pretty testing conditions. Yeah, I um, was nervy the first couple of holes. I hit a few little um, heel fades down the first couple of tee shots and was fortunate enough to hit another heel fade on the second and put myself to about six feet and I hold it. So settled the nerves a little bit. Um, yeah, then played very solid till about 10 and yeah, putter caught fire, which was, which was great. And yet I believe that you've left a couple out there too, a couple of three putts on holes where you had an eagle chance. Yeah, 11. 11, I yeah, actually hit a really good drive and a really good second shot. I just never putted up two tiers before. <laughs> so, um, yeah, yeah, that green's very funky. Um, so, yeah, I was, I was, I was all right. Like, my birdie 12 as well. 12's a pretty hard hole. Yeah. So, um, it was good enough that I hit a good um, good drive down there and hit a good wedge shot as well and got it close. And, yeah, just, just don't like that 14th hole, though. <laughs> That's it. So, you dunked your second? Yeah. I tried, tried going for it in two and I just hooked it a little bit and caught it with the wind and, yep, strain the drink. <laughs> That's a, how many times have you played the Australian Open now? This is my first. Your first. First round against the pros. Yep. Good group. Yep. That's a dream come true. Yeah, yeah. I've played with Nick before. I played in a pro-am with him uh, at, the mas uh, at the Aussie Masters, I think it was, in 2015. So, And also Roddy's a really good guy as well. So we all, we all hit it off uh, on the first hole, which was great. You didn't talk their ear off. Oh, I tried. I tried to get, try to keep my space, but um, no, nah, they'll they'll like they're all really nice. They all all chatted. We'll all had some fun, which was good. What do you take away from that first up? The first round. Yeah. Uh, I played pretty well. I, I I think the 18th was probably my first miss iron shot. Um, where I just like miss it short, but it was in the perfect spot where mm. I could make up and down. But I hit it great. I hit it really really good. I guess the question more is, do you feel like it's just another tournament for you because you've been playing and scoring so well, or is it the yeah. national championship and it's going to bite you at some point? It probably will. I don't know. Um, but I, I don't know. I've, I've played this is my fourth pro event in a row, so um, I think I'm, I'm not over it. Like I've still got the nerves, but it's just like I'm just I'm just going to play golf and just let the results take care of itself. Really. What was the club into fourteen? Three would. Yeah. And you feel more. You're not over it, but you feel more comfortable each one of these pro events you teared up in. Yeah. Pretty much, pretty much. I think uh, Fiji was probably a good starting point with um, like all the cameras and all that. And then uh, Asian Amateur was the same kind of deal as well. Um, and got, got used to that, had a good first round there as well. So um, this now, it, it, it kind of feels normal as, like, as much as it isn't, but it, it, yeah, it kinda, I kind of feel like I'm, I belong now, which is good. And just one of those days where the weather's annoying, little bits of light rain, wind, yeah. everything like that. Yeah. But you're obviously just pretty comfortable with it, and conditions were tough, but didn't seem to get you too much. I'm from Melbourne. This is <laughs> this is nothing really. Um, yeah, and the wind, the wind is just like Melbourne as well. So I really, really felt like I was back in Melbourne, which was great. Do you, have you had many many rounds of the lakes before? I played the Aussie Amateur here in 2015. This was, I think, we only played the course once. So I think I've had two rounds here before before coming this week. What were your goals at the start of the week, mate? And do you reset them now? Nah, just play as good as I can. Just let the result take care of itself. If I miss the cut by 25 or if I make the cut, if I'm up there after the first round, it still doesn't matter. Just go and hit each shot as good as I can. You know better than just about anyone Aaron Baddeley's story and, you know, yep. Does yep. it flash through your mind? Oh, not really. Not until you, <laughs> not until you told me. <laughs> uh, it'll, be, it'll be great, but three, round, three rounds to go. Plenty, round of, plenty rounds of golf to go, so just got to keep in all the good shots and keep the bad shots out of the way. Good start, mate. Well played. Thank you.